Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and this video is exclusively for one of our friends who have asked about India Bull Housing Finance and before going to this video guys, if you are new to this channel then make sure you click the subscribe button below so that you could get our latest updates and what not guys even if not subscribe, see this video fully so that you could get our information and see what you are trying to say guys and moving on, India Bull Housing Finance is a good NDFC company and it is having the results on February 5, 2020 which means February 3rd today, tomorrow and day after tomorrow is the result of this company and moving this company is having a book value of roughly around 400 rupees book value of 400 rupees this company is trading in the range of 264 as you can see here price to book is 0.68 m that is the share is undervalued but guys, keeping all those facts away, now which made this like companies to get down, the reason was because due to budget there has been a deep fall and you should note that this fall is not constant or compulsory. But if you see the futures and options data, the futures is now trading in the range of 252 to be precise, yes guys, I mean this month futures is now trading in the range of 252 and we are very shocked to see why so such a discount has been seen in this company. I mean now it is in 27th February 2020 future is now trading in the range of 251 rupees guys and March future is trading in the range of 248. So if you want to, if you have a belief on the result that is going to come on 5th February then if chance this market if evening goes down 248 to 252 would be the best buying range. Suppose if it not comes down to that level or if you don't want to wait at the, at to, up to that level then buy now suppose you want to buy 100 shares buy 10 shares at 263 rupees guys. If it comes down again 3 rupees buy an another 10 shares. So buy part by part so that at the end of the market your average price also comes down and also your per share price also comes down so when this all things turn positive you can be able to gain it and also you should note that Credit Suicide Singapore means a rating agency or it's an investment company bought 72 crore worth of shares in India Bull Housing Finance guys so two things there are negative now one thing is that futures and options data are negative it is showing in the range of 251 rupees but on another side a big investment company bought India Bull Housing Finance before the result so that is a good news for India Bull Housing Finance investors so if you want to go by the bad thing then you can short short India Bulls but I think it will not go much down guys but if you want to have a potential buy then buy part by part because credit to say a big investment company has bought around 72 crore worth of amount shares in India Bull Housing Finance so this is our view on India Bull Housing Finance again I repeat guys 252 is the last breaking late I mean last breakage limit for this company so acquire part by part if you have belief thank you so much guys